next guest is a true warrior. He is also the host of NBC's big hit, American Ninja Warrior. I love watching that show. I feel pretty bad about myself after it because I couldn't do anything on it, but I really like watching it. And he claims in his new book, everyone can be a ninja. And that's a nuanced thought. We're going to talk about it with him right now. Please welcome back to our show, Akbar Baja B of Mil... I hope I said that right. Um, whatever, he'll come out and correct you me. Got that right. I got that right. Hey, how you doing? Yeah, no. Yes, there you go. Yes. Hey, guys. Everyone Could Be a Ninja is about so much more than your physical ability. Yeah, yeah, you know, Everyone Can Be a Ninja is really talking about overcoming personal obstacles. On the show, you get to see these ninjas overcome the physical obstacle on the course, but in life, we all have obstacles, like saying Baja Bia Miller is one obstacle I had growing not, up. Not that and, and No, no, but not, not that, that one, but uh, you know, there's a chapter where I talk about my dad telling me, make them say your name. And as you can imagine, growing up, and you can relate being Italian, but growing oh, up in my an American. Brother, <laughs> my little brother is Emmanuel Nino Scuderi Ray. And yeah. he, when he had to fill out his name on a paper, it took up the entire paper. Yeah, and I'm <laughs> Akbar Oluwakemi Idowu Baja Bia Miller. There you go. <laughs> yes. That's and every so, letter. Yeah, and so in school, you know, I would have, you know, raise my hand like, no, that's me, because I didn't want to be made fun of, because the kids would tease me relentlessly. And my dad would say, make them say your name. Make them say your name. Aww. And the message that I learned then is that you have to be comfortable in who you are and, and what you are and proud of who you are and just being able to embrace that. I'm sure you paid it forward with your own children in your own life. Yeah. What are some of the lessons that you think are most important and how is your own family life going? Well, for me, the, look I at think, that. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, look yeah, at that yeah, There they are, the twins. That's you can see ridiculous. The, I have my, that, that's Elijah on the left, my, my 10-year-old daughter, Saidat, and Nasir and Naomi are the twins, my beautiful wife, Crystal, oh, uh, uh, right there. What and a so, family. Yeah, family of four. Yeah. I try to tell them, you know, one of the things, you know, seeing the ninjas, you know, fall, come back the next year, fall, come back the next year. Those are great lessons for kids. Not every re kid wins at everything. That's exactly you right. Keep trying. And I tell them, I say, look up, stand up, and don't ever give up. And if you have that mindset, I think you're going to be all right. I think you're going to be all right. Yeah. You make me want to try in all the right ways. Um, Jojo was telling me, our producer was telling me that you're a diaper ninja. Oh, yes. Well, look, uh, I've changed a I, lot of diapers. <laughs> I don't know if I want to know what that means. No, no, just meaning I can, I can oh, change. Oh, you can do it well. Yes, yes, okay. I can do it well and fast, and I'm the swaddle king. In fact, many people on the street, you know, my hood name used to be Big Ock, but now they call me, <laughs> now they call me swaddle king because I can swaddle any baby and they'll never get out. They'll never get out. I love you. You're thank a warrior you so for me. Yeah, I think you you're wonderful. Thank you so much. Um, I love meeting people that are beautiful yeah. inside now. Everyone Can Be a Ninja is in stores now and available, of course, everywhere books are sold.